Welcome to our PGA Tour coverage here on 2K Sports. We're at the Tall Palms Classic. Today's coverage is about to start. I'm Luke Elvey with Rich Beam in the booth and we've got John McCarthy down on the course. Thanks, Luke. So pleased to be here at the Jumeirah Club today and what a way to start your day with this long par four staring deep into the downtown area. Oh my goodness. Can't wait to see what happens here today. Hello, everyone. Oh, goodness me. Hello. Welcome back to PGA Tour. God, I love this game. Um, okay, so... We've come off the back of a rather painful loss. Uh, basically got an eagle on the 17th and then bogeyed the 18th and lost by one shot. So, yeah, pretty pissed about that, but we'll see. Let's drop it back here because it's an 8 iron, so it's going to roll a little bit. Going with the 8 iron here. Well, good looking shot here. That's headed towards the green. Oh! Great. It just missed the hole. Well, that certainly makes putting a lot easier when you can hit a shot like that. Yeah, you tell me about it. Nothing gets past you. done with that last, last back, um, match. Putt coming up is for birdie. Okay. Not a bad line, miss. Oh. That's pretty fancy. Nice start. Yeah, you got Imagine all those people those in the building there early. looking We're down on the, for the, rest of the day. on people while they're playing uh, golf. Offer up that hope oh goodness me, run. look at this. Five miles an hour. Where's the hole? Okay, let's drop it about there. Going with the six iron here. Oh, this is on a fantastic line. Is it the right distance? <sighs> Little bounce to the left there when it landed. I mean, I would have liked to have hit the flag. Oh, hello, bit of roll. Not a bad approach, that one up onto the green. A couple of putts from there, and that'll be a pretty good hole. Couple. Here, I want to try and get one if I can. Birdies moving him in the right direction. Let's see. No, not even close. Jeez. Putting for par. Oh, goodness me, look at that. Ooh, nice line. Phew. Nicely hold. And for par. Currently one under for the event. Mm. Unfortunately, backing up slowly but surely on that leaderboard, Luke. This Rather not do that if I can avoid it. There we go. In the fairway. So that's not too shabby, really, under the circumstances. Time for the second shot into the third. Two miles an hour. Let's see if we can drop it there. I have a funny feeling it may bounce and then roll into the bunker on the right. See, it was going in that direction. And here we are with the third shot. Nice little pitch. Oh, could have done with a bit more to the right. Just Never mind. Seven feet to the hole. And I was going to say relatively straight, but no, that's not relatively straight in the slightest. Ooh, nice looking part. But it's good that uh, you guys oh, find watching this game relaxing as well, I play. Uh, I find it relaxing to play as well. Oh, hello. Off here at the fourth. So here's the second. Let's see. Let's drop it there. Sorry, not the second. It was two miles an hour is what and I really meant. One. There we go. In the fairway. A couple under at this stage. Currently tied for first place. So this is seven iron. So it's going to roll some. And it's a normal shot. Two miles an hour. So yeah, let's drop it there. Looks to have chosen the seven iron. Yeah. 
I think we can be relatively, oh, see, a bit more roll than I would have liked. A bit more roll than I would have liked. Oh my goodness, look at that break. That is nuts, so. Tracking. Got it. And with that putt hold, it's back to back birdies. Gotta like it. Not too shabby, I'd say. And at the end of that hole, he's gone into clear outright leader. The play so far has been stellar, increasing the lead loop, but can they maintain it? Let's find we out. shall see. Okay, so three miles an hour, it's very tight sort of fairway area, and I've got to be careful of that. So if I put it sort of about there, I think. Wasn't happy with that swing. That should find the fairway. Yeah, there we go. Threaded it down the middle. Happy with that. Good year. Three wins so far this season. So we're doing a sand wedge. It's going to bounce about here. This hill should drop it down to there. But it won't bounce too much. And it's three miles an hour to the left. So let's do there, I think. Well, I like that strike. This one's hitting well towards the green. Oh, uh, not too bad. Not too bad. Gee, I wish I could play like this myself. Well, the practice is paying off here, Luke. This player is relentless. A good stroke. But Thank God for that. This is impressive. Got to say, putting this well from this distance is a huge confidence booster. Where's my opponent or the, the guy who won it last time? Maybe he's pissed and enjoying himself. God only knows. I'm Justin. So, because at the moment, my current uh, rival is Jim Furyk. If you've ever seen him play golf, he uh, does have a rather unusual swing. But saying that, so that's going to be a pitch. So it's going to be about there, I reckon. Let's see. A very unusual swing, but he is... He still hits it well, you know. Consistent. Oh, baby. Hit the flag. Settle for that. There we go. Oh, Billy Horschel. Russell Knox, Jonathan Vegas, Sergio Garcia, no less. Let's just check that again, because if there's zero, I want it a bit there. I don't want to roll, take the risk of rolling there. Here we go. Good looking shot, this. Yeah, happy with that. Time for the second shot here. Have now, one second. mile an hour. Oh my goodness. Can I bounce it there? Is the question. It's a three wood, so it's going to roll somewhat. So, let's see if we get a nice bounce. Oh, yes, we got a nice bounce. Even though we're in the sort of bottom half of the green. Well, that's showcasing their power there, Rich. Using the big boy muscles to get it home in two there. Oh, you set yourself up with an eagle opportunity. Oh, oh, look at that. Quite keep blimey. Let's give it a go. Oh, crap, way too hard. Oh, yep, gee, see. Was looking good, wasn't it? For birdie. He just keeps putting a He's still got a birdie. A Eagle would have been nice, but you know. Six under par, six under par three, three shots three ahead of the nearest. Oh, Justin's on his way. Three shots ahead. Just a couple of play here on the opening nine. Here's the tee shot at the eight. Okay. Oh, let's see if they can roll off that birdie at the last. Lovely momentum here. Now let's see. Tee shot at the eighth. A pitching wedge, a normal shot, means if we drop it sort of about here, hopefully, it will. Now, the thing is, a pitching wedge will go very high. So, let's put it there. Going with the pitching wedge here. A bit of a curve. This one's going right at the pin here. Oh, oh, oh baby. Here at the eighth. 
Look at that. Very happy with that shot indeed. Very happy indeed. Oh look, hello Boaty. He sits in first position. Very strange looking boat. I'm pretty sure this player will be buoyed by that birdie back at the last. Let's see if they can deliver another one. Now, the thing is, obviously, we don't want to be too close to here because it makes a sort of difficult sort of thread it through the needle sort of approach to the green. So if we drop it here, we just have to hope that we don't carry on to the, the, onto the rough. Time for the second shot which we did not. Now, this is an eight iron, and we've got to be careful because we don't want to sort of roll it down there. I think about it there will do, because then it's going to sort of hit and roll a little bit. And choosing the eight iron here. Here's the roll. Oh, baby. What a shot. Simply astounding. What a hole out. What a play. Leading by six strokes after that one. Blimey. Well, <clears throat> hopefully I am to me, the redeeming myself the after the failure of the last uh, competition. Nice hole, the last one coming off that eagle. Let's see what's in store for us now. Let's see. So nice uh, approach, but we are going over some green, uh, some bunkers. Now this is a pitch. Two miles an hour is not going to go far, and it's probably going to stop very quickly. In fact, it rolled a bit more than I expected it to, but I suppose that's the speed of the green. Eleven feet to the cup. Short game has been absolutely fantastic today. Get excited. This could yep, we're in. And that's eight birdies today. Wow. Look at that. Birdie, 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 birdie. <laughs> Makes me sound like that robot from flipping Buck Rogers. Beedy, beedy. But never mind. This hole here is a par four. Okay. So two miles an hour. Thread it through the, the centre here. Onto the fairway, and then a rough approach on to past the stones here. Are they... This shot coming from around the 150-yard hmm. marker. Eight iron, so we're going to get some roll. So I think if we drop it about there, it should drop there and then roll sort of like that. Really bad swing. Yep. Yep, I'll settle for that. Of all the shots that I like the most, that one ranks right up there. Thank you. Lining up the birdie putt here. I don't mind the look of this. No, and I don't either. Goes. And with it, an increase of his lead. Wow. Back to back birdies moving the right direction. There, oh, Luke. Justin's no way to be seen. He's having a bad still day. In top spot after that hole. Keep it going. Time to make a move. The tee is yours here at the 12th hole. Nice birdie back there. On to the next. Let's drop it there. Spanking it down the centre. Nice. And the effort, that one. Reminds me, I need to look for my flipping Santa hat to record a, uh, a video for you lovely people um, for Christmas. for the nine iron a little bit of drift to the right bounce and roll now had I been aiming a bit oh my goodness that's a lot of roll had I been aiming a bit more to the right probably would have been better but never mind let's see oh that'll good that'll do Oh. Ahead at the top of the just snuck it in there. So no change on the leaderboard for this player after that hole. Quite pleased. Let's see what happens here at the 13th. So, 
And they again another very narrow green. Yeah, this is a quality looking shot, this one. That should find the short stuff. Now, one thing I do do because of that, this is what enables me to do the swing with the mouse. Kind of keep it relatively straight. Now, this is a three wood, so we're going to see some carry. And some roll. And he says that, and he does a swing like that. Here we go. And then we got a roll down the hill. Always like the aggressive play, going for it in two and get rewarded for it. Okay, let's see what happens here. It's going to drop down and then straighten. Hmm. We'll have to wait and see on that one. Right. I think there might do it. See how this goes. Oh, bit of travel. Twelve feet to the cup coming up. There we go. See how that runs. Come on. Okay, so we want it to go about there. This one's online. And that's for yes, it is. Well hold. It's <laughs> online. Wow. He's currently sitting in first place. Blimey. I don't give the rest of the field much hope today. Our leader is way out in front in this final round. Ten shots ahead. Jesus it's Christ. The but the point is, don't get complacent. Go for, you know, it's nice to have a buffer. But you don't want to get complacent because that's when it comes back to bite you in the arse. Going with the seven. Oh, well, what a shot. And he's safely on the green with that shot. Yes, he is. Opportunity to make a birdie. So if we drop it a bit there. I think. Too hard. Way too hard. Opportunity to make their par. That was careless. It's half a chance of being hold this one. Yeah, At least we stayed ahead, we didn't drop a shot. And this is quality play, still on top of the leaderboard. And so I two miles an hour. Let's today. drop it it's about here, I think, because hopefully it will at least cover so it goes that way. Won't go straight ahead onto the uh, rough. No! This will take a big hack to get out here. Well, let's have a go, shall we? Big hack. Come on. Yeah, I'll settle for that. That's a good looking shot there. Yeah, I think so too. Coming up to the cup. So we just want to aim to the right a little bit. Looking good. He's making this look easy. Keeps surging ahead. Hmm. A nice feeling it must be to have that sizable of a lead coming down the stretch. Damn right. Okay, so if we drop it there, that should kill the forward momentum quite significantly. Let's give that a go. Opting for the three wood. Oh, it went further than I expected. It's fair to say that that approach didn't hit the mark. No, it what did a not. Rare miss today. They've been so good with their approach shots. Ooh, that almost went down. Yes, it did. Big power saver coming up for this fella. Okay, let's try and save the par. I don't really want to drop any shots on this uh, particular competition. Good looking putt. Yeah, good putt. Well hold. Thank you. Glad you approve. Currently 14 under for the event. Yay! Two holes to go, Luke. Can they hang on? 
Let's find out. Two miles an hour. A little bit to the left, I think. Real bad swing. Look at that. Well, I like the look of the line here. They should find the fairway. One of the things I learned from actually playing golf in real life, the same it's the same with snooker. That um, you don't have to hit it hard. It depends on how solid your basic technique is, and you, you hit it sweetly. So you know, the seven iron's going to have a bit of carry. It might slow down because of this sort of incline, but we'll see. And it's going relatively high because it's a seven. But look at that, it's going straight for the flag. So I can't complain really. <clears throat> or maybe I could see a little bit of a roll down. So I would have liked it to have gone a bit further. John, have you got a read on this one? Well, guys, it's about 22 feet to go here. Let's have a look. Oh, God. So we're going to have to go up here a bit, like this. Um, and over a little bit like that. Get in! Oh, you bugger, it just, just moved off. Between here and the hole. Looks good off the blade. There we go. Oh, yeah, sorry, I get a bit quiet when I'm trying to focus on my putting because I don't really want to drop a shot. Here we are on the 18th. Let's see how we get on. And, um, I mean, speaking from golfers wise. Um, regarded as probably having one of the best swings in the game is a guy called Ernie Earls from South Africa. Great classic swing he has. It's uh, poetry in motion, literally. Now, we should, in theory, be able to do a nice little chip on. And maybe roll it in. No! Oh, God, where's he going? Let's see where this one goes, shall we? Nowhere. <clears throat> oh, that's really good. That's really helpful. So let's go over here somewhat. Well, at least we're on that right area. And there we have it. He's it for the victory. Well Woo! Absolutely. 14 yeah. under. Very it's happy. I believe that this player's already got four victories on the season. Top of the game right now. It's impressive. I'm Luke Elvey, alongside Rich Beam. And on behalf of all the hardworking folks at HB Studios, it's goodbye for now. Goodbye.